Hey everybody and welcome back to one more video on our channel. Uh, I am super excited about this video. I haven't seen anybody else do anything like this um, and it has helped me so much when it comes to menu planning and trying to save that extra time and extra money from going back to the grocery store, from impulse buying and all that good stuff are actually bad stuff. <laughs> uh, it's gonna save you a lot of money and save you time in trying to think out those recipes that you can do to fill up your week. So I'm gonna show you how I put this pack together. This comes in a little set on our site um, or on our shop, Breezy Organization on Etsy.com. You get these two sheets, comes with two washi backgrounds and two skinny backgrounds. And then it has the favorites menu with the breakfast, lunch, snack, and dinner, and lots of cute stickers that you can use with your monthly layout. Um, for lunch date, date night, eat out, host dinner. There's a lot more grocery shopping and eating out than there is hosting dinners because I'm assuming if you're anything like me, you don't have a lot of time to host a lot of dinners anyways. So we try to put stickers on there that you guys would use more often, but I'm absolutely loving these sheets and you can find them linked below and they're in our shop. I am using my Erin Condren planner and it's a sheet that's right in the front so I can easily turn to it whenever I am planning our groceries. So it's right before the January tab and I already put the washi down on top. Okay, and then next we are going to put this favorites menu sticker on top of our really cute black and white stripe washi, which never goes out of style. Okay. We are going to peel off the breakfast, lunch, and dinner stickers. So we're going to put, I like doing kind of like little um, blocks. So let me put, let's see, I'll put breakfast right here. Okay. And then let's add the lunch, breakfast, lunch and dinner. So basically this is going to be like a dashboard. Let's go about down here for dinner. This is going to be a dashboard for you to look off of. I actually do grocery store pickup at Walmart for my meals because I just don't have time to go grocery shopping right now with the kids and everything else I have to do in the day. So I try to do grocery store pickup every week and it saves me from like impulse buying and stuff. So I love having this little dashboard, um, this little dashboard to go off of for my getting my groceries and I'm not racking my brain um, trying to figure out what do we eat every week? What sounds good this week? I can just look at this list and be like, oh yeah, hey, that sounds really good and make my list from that. Okay. So I'm going to put this, I think, I'm gonna put it here or here and then put one down here. Put one here. Super, super cute. I love that black and white stripe and I went too far over on that side. But it's all good. It's all good. Okay. And then I'm just gonna close off the bottom down here. Maybe I can get it the right way this time. There we go. So they actually have a tool for this <laughs> that I have in my scrapbook supplies, but tweezers work the same way. So it's all good. And this will make it a lot more fun. I love all the colorful dots. It'll give me a starting place to write in all of the breakfasts and lunches and dinners. And I will probably just speed up this part of the video so you don't have to watch me put in a hundred million dots.
okay now that we have all of those on and I definitely started going to the right but that's okay um I am going to make a list of all of our um things that we eat so for breakfast we do fruit cereal yogurt um toast and jelly um let's see oatmeal um muffins cinnamon rolls pancakes um eggs of course and bacon um and that's all i think on that for right now and then for lunches we do let's see what do we do for lunches <laughs> see this is why i have my list um let's see tacos hamburgers and fries, um, salad, wraps, um, frozen pizza, please no judgment, <laughs> frozen pizza, let's see, PB&J, um, let's see, a sandwich, And stew chicken fingers. Okay, so those are our lunches that we can pick from. And then let's see, let's go on down to dinners. Uh, dinners we have fish tacos, which is one of my favorites. Um, steak, thick pork chops, um, roast, zupa, veggie soup, um, ziti, chili, sorry, a lot of them start coming out. chicken. Um, let's see, shrimp and broccoli and shrimp boil packs. We'll just put shrimp boil on here and then bacon. I'm just going to put bacon chicken, but it's bacon wrapped chicken. Um, baby back ribs. Baby back ribs and um, Hasselback chicken. Um, spicy sausage pasta. Spicy, I don't know if I'm gonna have room for this or not. Just barely. Okay, and then our last one would be probably um, lemon chicken. Okay, and then our snacks. Let's do our snacks real quick. Um, let's see, we have crackers and cheese. Um, fruit baby carrots you guys can hear my kids in the other room hopefully that's not too distracting um cheese cubes cheese cubes hummus and graham crackers ha it is really hard to write when your hands up on that thing okay 
So basically here is my list and then um, I will just pull our groceries or menu items um, for that list. I'll write it into my um, week, what we're going to eat and then I'll go and I pretty much know all the ingredients to all these because they're the meals that we have all the time. But I'm telling y'all, it saves so much time to have a dashboard of everything that you eat. It saves money, I think, and it saves time. So I hope you enjoyed this. You can pick up these cute stickers to use in your Air Conjure planner and they also fit other planners as well on our Etsy shop at Breezy Organization on Etsy.com. Uh, be sure to follow us and subscribe if you wanna see more videos like this. Leave us a comment and a thumbs up and we will catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.